everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be decorating my horizontal happy planner for the week of January 10th through the 16th. And for this week's spread, I'm going to use this new Stargazer sticker book. This sticker book came in the recent Be Happy box, the Stargazer Be Happy box. So I will link that box down below in the description if you want to check it out. And there's not a lot of stickers in here. This is only um, a 15 sheet sticker book. So I have the um, original Stargazer sticker book. So I'm gonna combine the two. So I'm gonna go ahead and take the pages out and get started. So I already have a few stickers in mind that I wanna use. Um, I also have an unboxing of this Be Happy box on my channel. So I will link it above and in the description. Um, so I really like these quotes and I like these other ones, but they have silver foil. So I think I'm gonna start with these. So there's this really big one right here that I love. So I might put this, hmm. I mean, it takes up a lot of room on Sunday. So I was just gonna put this in the notes section, but this M like loops around, so. I don't know if I want to cut that off. This sheet isn't foiled, so I'm going to take one of these. This is like hard to get off the page. Okay, so I'm going to take one of these and I figured I could add in some black. So I have this Everyday Wrong Wrong sticker book and there's this black like double box. I'm going to cover up the girls. And honestly, this Today sticker has like pink and blue and it kind of matches those colors. So I'm gonna pull that one. But this one, I was gonna layer these two together. So I'm gonna white those girls out. So I layered this box and then I chose a different quote that fits um, nicer on the page, I think. The other one was just a little too big, so I will save that for something else. Um, but in the original Stargazer sticker book, there's these like leaves. So I think I'm going to use some of those. So I think I want this big one with this cluster. And then I think I'm going to put this here. Okay, so I'm gonna cut off the extra on this side. And then I have some grid washi and I think I'm gonna layer right here. And then, okay, I think that's a pretty good cluster. So I'm gonna move on to maybe a cluster over here. So I have this Today sticker. I think I'm gonna put it up here. Um, and then I'm gonna grab some more leaves to cluster with it. I think I'm gonna cut this off a little bit it's like super long layer it like that okay um have these cute little sparkles that I want to use also and I have some smaller quotes I think I want like another big quote so maybe like this one yeah hmm. 
I don't know how to layer this with that though. Because I don't want it over the black line. So... I don't know. I'll figure that out. But I think I want to put this down. Oh no. I'm going to put this down on Monday. Okay, this is not working. I hate, like the one thing I like about making these clusters is that I don't have to keep lifting stickers up, but like it's really difficult to put them down like in one big cluster. Okay, so there's that. And then I'm gonna add some washi. Okay, and let me see, I really want to add this quote somewhere, but I feel like it kind of looks awkward. I mean, I could put it like this, maybe? Yeah, I think I'm going to put it like that. Okay, cute. Um, I'm gonna add some of these sparkles maybe. Ooh, the silver ones I think would look super cute. I'm just worried I won't be able to take a good photo of it. Silver foil, any foil. It's kind of difficult to take a photo of but I feel like if I just have these in a few places it's not as bad as like these silver quotes so I think that is super cute and then I'm gonna add another one to this other cluster I have okay I think that's good for now. Oh my gosh, I'm loving the colors of this. Ooh, I really like this. Or the dreamer, but I have a quote right there, so maybe I'll add this to the notes section. Just to add a little bit like more. I think I'm gonna wait on that and see because I'm really unsure about that. So let me see what else I can add. These are like super foiled. So I'm probably not gonna add those in this spread. I'm gonna go back to these because I want another box like this on the other page. So I can probably put this down here and layer it with something else. So in this Wrong Wrong Everyday book, I have some black boxes. Okay, I have a scallop here, so I feel like it needs to go somewhere else on this page. So I could probably add it somewhere else too, but okay. I think I'm going to layer the black box on the left side so it doesn't look too much like this cluster. Like right there. Yeah. Ooh, washi. So I need to leave enough room on the bottom for some washi. So I'm gonna put that down. And then this is gonna go right here okay i'm gonna put this here
Okay, I feel like some of the ends of the washi tape I cut are like not cut good. So I'm gonna take my exacto knife and just kind of fix that. Okay, cleaner edge. So now that I have that, I need to grab another black box just so the scallop can be on the other side. And I also have these square today stickers and there's like a blue color in that that kind of matches. So I'm gonna use that. So let me see where I can put this. Probably up here. Okay, and then I don't want it to look like that, so I'm going to move this over a little bit so I can layer these together. And, oh, I have some more leaves I need to add. So I have this one but I'm thinking it looks too much like these on the same page. So I'm gonna have a different one, like this one. I totally forgot about this, but luckily these stickers are peeling up nicely. And then maybe something for there I don't know um let's see what else I can add if I can add some more like stars okay have some big ones which are super pretty just don't know where to put them Probably right here. Okay, yeah. Um, okay, next. Honestly, I could combine like these colored ones. I feel like that would look super cute. I don't know, maybe, maybe. Okay, so I have in this like bigger book some washi strips. Okay, so I think I'm just gonna put this washi in with the clusters because I wanted to put some here, here, and here, but I don't have enough to do that. So um, I'm just going to layer this with uh, my clusters. Okay, so I got these um, washi strips or the washi stickers down and looking at this, I think I want to move this over here because it's kind of like right on top of each other. Okay, and I think I am going to put this sticker here. I think that just looks so cute. Okay, so I got that on. I think that is super cute so now I think the last thing maybe not the last thing 
second to last. I'm gonna, um, bullet points right here. I'm gonna use those on some days, um, like Wednesday. I'm gonna put one and then where else? Maybe Sunday. Okay. And then in the um, original Stargazer, there's some of these purple hearts or stars. So I'm going to put these somewhere. Where can I put them? Maybe with this cluster since it really has nothing. Okay, and going back to this one, there is one more cluster of like stars. So I'm just gonna use that up. So I have it here. Maybe I can add it with this cluster actually. Hmm. I think I might cut this top one out and put that somewhere else. Put this here. I'll put these stars back. And then this one can maybe go over here. So I think I'm going to be done with this spread. I think it turned out super cute. I don't want to, I mean, I know I kind of wanted to add like a quote here to this cluster and add something else. I don't know, maybe like, I don't know. I just, this is my journaling planner, so I don't want to add too much because um, sometimes I don't have enough room to write. So I'm going to go ahead and put this back into my planner. So that is my spread. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you in my next one.